at Howelson Hill and Steamboat Springs. I am the Howelson Ski and Rodeo Manager. Brad Setter says there's a rich history with winter sports. We're the oldest operating uh, ski area in North America. And a long history forming underground in this cave. This cave has been here for thousands of years. Where Sulphur Spring flows into Sulphur Cave and inside the air is so toxic humans can't survive for long. High levels of carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. Uh, you can pass out literally in seconds if not minutes and it can be fatal to humans. But inside, scientists in protective gear recently discovered living formations found in only five other caves in the world. They have bacteria in them that metabolizes. But this cave is known for more than just its rare formations. Because while it's toxic for humans to go inside, there is life in this cave. And this is the only place it's ever been discovered. This is the only place on Earth that these worms are known to exist. With blood red worms found in this cave that actually live in sulfuric acid. They've got an unusual blood system that allows them to live and to thrive in that environment. And worms that could help explorers find life in outer space. Clues to what we might find on other planets. All inside a cave that's going to become a national natural landmark. Very unique, very exciting. And Brad says makes Steamboat Springs unlike any other place on Earth. We're very excited to have this and to protect this. Pretty cool stuff up in Steamboat Springs. So the cave will soon, it's at least expected, to be designated as a national natural landmark. The Secretary of Interior has to sign off on the paperwork. That's expected to happen in the coming days or weeks, so relatively soon. And then, Gary, what that means is Steamboat can protect the stream that flows into the cave, protect the cave, and continue to explore it and find who knows what. Yeah, for sure. I mean, what I love about that story is you walk by there and it just looks like they fenced off a hole in the ground. You know, you don't know what's under there. Right. Man, <laughs> just looks like a sinkhole, but it's a whole nother world. I guess so. All right, Matt, good stuff. Thanks for that.